multiple members of the state executive and legislative arm of government, as well as political elites of the All Progressives Congress, APC, at the 18th Executive and Legislative Parley, teamed engaging all for inclusive governance, hands-on for a greater Lagos rising. Governor Babaji Desonolo, while delivering his address, stressed that the synergy between the executive and legislature stands as a pivotal force behind Lagos' monumental achievements. There are global issues, there are national issues, there are state issues, there are community issues. You know, and so each one of those issues, as leaders, as people that the citizens believe in, you know, is, this, is that a force on our shoulder and we must be able to rise up. Delivering the keynote address, the former Minister for Works and Housing, Babatunde de Fashala, urged political office holders to manifest the essence of governance, which is delivering the dividends of democracy to the people. If people are facing a cost of living crisis, one of the things that we can do is to increase the quantum of money at their disposal. We can drive sustainable development and foster a more prosperous future for all Lagosians. In the separate remarks, some political stakeholders noted that the executive and legislative parley of the Lagos state government will foster a harmonious relationship between the state's executive and legislative arm of government for the benefit of Lagosians. We as politicians have taken the task of ministry into the need of the people, the welfare of I know uh, it's difficult, but please just be patient. You will soon begin to see signs of development. We will need an adapted, adapted uh, parliamentary system of government suitable for our own situation and circumstance. The 18th edition of the Executive and Legislative Parley of the Lagos State Government is expected to evaluate the scorecard of the Lagos State Government and suggest future steps for Lagos Rising. In Lagos,